Hello guys, welcome to Nabar Division Snipet Series. Today we will be discussing about the highlights of agriculture sector announced in budget 2025-26. So in the budget 2025-26, agriculture has been announced as India's first engine of development as it contributes 18.2% to GDP with an annual average growth rate of 5% from the year 2017 to 2023. This year the ministry has been allocated rupees 1.37 lakh crore which is a reduction of 2.7 5 percentage from the revised estimates of 2024-25 however for the allied and processing sectors the budget has been rather increased now what are the new missions that has been announced in this year's budget number one is the pm dhan dhanya krishi yojana which would cover 100 low productivity districts and the yojana has been designed in line with aspirational districts program next is the mission for atmanibhar ten pulses which is a six-year mission where it targets self-sufficiency in tur urad and masur the third initiative announced in Budget 2025-26 is the establishment of a Makhana board in Bihar. And the fourth initiative is regarding the revision of the modified interest subvention scheme where the loan limit has been increased from Rs 3 lakhs to 5 lakhs and the KCC benchmark interest rate has been earmarked at 9%. The fifth initiative is the Rural Prosperity and Resilience Program which aims to cover 100 developing agri districts in Phase 1. The program aims to reduce rural underemployment and migration via skilling and technology. The sixth initiative is the Comprehensive Program for Vegetables and Fruits which has an allocation of Rs 500 crore for 2025-26. Next initiative is regarding the 5-year mission for cotton productivity which aims on sustainable productivity and extra long staple cotton under the 5F framework. The 8th initiative is the national mission on high yielding seeds which supports 100 plus high yielding pest resistant and climate resistant varieties. Apart from this, the key infrastructure announcements made in budget 2025-26 is the establishment of a urea plant in Assam with a capacity of 1.27 million tons per year and a second national gene bank which would house 10 lakh germplasm lines for future food and nutritional security. That's all for today. Follow Clarity for Sure for more such informative series. Thank you.